Hello guys, welcome back to a new video. Today it's Wednesday, June 19th. I'm starting the video pretty much now. I added some clips from what we did at the beginning of the week, in the beginning of this video. My mom's cousin came over for a few days, so we had uh, a nice visit with her and we took her to visit Blue Mountain. It's a very popular ski resort in the winter time here in Ontario, Canada. And it was really, really weird to see it without any snow around. I, if, I haven't really been there during the winter time just because I've never actually skied or been there to do exactly that. It was really cute. So we went for a walk there, but then we didn't really stay long. And then we went to Wasaga Beach, which is another pretty popular spot during the summertime, a lot of people go there, they have cottages and they spend their summertime or their vacation there. And I've never been there. So it was really, really nice to see it and visit these local places to me that I haven't really been to or traveled to. So yeah, it was nice. Now I'm getting, I'm ready. Uh, I was getting ready because I'm going to Toronto again today to meet my mom and my sister and then going to Niagara on the lake to see a play for the Shaw Festival. I guess this video is more of local things that you can do in Ontario, Canada and uh, which are outside of Toronto. So if you ever want to go on a day trip outside of Toronto when you visit or if you're in the city um, and you want to leave the city, uh, you can just go and check these places out. They're pretty fun and it's always a great time and nice to discover new places outside of a popular uh, famous city. I think I'm pretty much done packing everything that I need to take with me. I'm taking my computer as well because I also have a meeting at 12 p.m. so I actually have to go to the train now, get to my aunt's place have this meeting and then we'll leave. This meeting is about a workshop that I'm going to take in Italy, but I'll tell you more about it in the coming weeks because there's so much going on, so much that's happening and it's gonna be fun. If you like travel videos, if you want to see more of Italy and maybe other places in Europe, like this video and subscribe and Let's go on this adventure together. This is the outfit of the day. Very casual, a tank top on, very old tank top, but I love it so much. And then my newish Zara pants with my Uma sneakers. Southern Oregon. Um, and my blog focuses on small bat trust. Just finished the meeting and now we're on our way to, where are we going? Niagara on the lake with these two and bye we just arrived this is the room and the place is called What's it called? Pillars and Post. Oh, yeah, Pillar sure. and Post? Yeah. Nice. It's in Niagara on the lake. This is going to be our room for the night. We're going to see a play. Well, Hello. Yeah, to keep this up. Gonna... Hello. Ooh, that's scary. Scary light. What play are we going to see, Ma? Um, I forget. I forget. That's what it's called. Where are you going? In another person's room. <laughs> Witness for the prosecution. It's called Witness for the Prosecution. It's an Agatha Christie play. Mm -hmm. There you go. That's what we're gonna go I'm to sleepy look. Okay. <laughs> okay. Nice. I wanna sleep here. This one here. And I wanna sleep close to the window. I don't know why. So I'll be the first one to get. And this is the bathroom. Very practical, nice and clean. Nice frame. Going to the Monet Gardens. We're gonna go find them, but I don't know which way it is. 
Garden etiquette. Welcome to the gardens. Love of these flowers. Look at the roses. I always love going into a rose garden. I find that I can always find a rose garden in every city that I go to. These ones are a little bit dead. Oh, this is a nice one. So we're currently walking towards an Irish pub, the Irish Harp Park, I think. And we're gonna go have dinner uh, before we go and see the play. Who's excited? <laughs> Who's excited? Parla in inglese. Who's excited? Just say yes. Yes. Yay, for the play. Oh yeah. <laughs> that was exciting. Yeah, so we're just walking to Hiya. dinner. I'm really hungry. Can't wait for dinner. And it's very, very warm right now. So we're gonna go and sit on the patio and have a drink and eat dinner. Cheers! Everything is closed though because oh. it's about what seven almost seven pm. Six thirty. Oh six thirty. So, so dark. yeah. But it's very, very cute. I'll show you around. Right? <laughs> right. <laughs> You're liking the anger on the lake? I do. I really like it. Well, you it's like, very peaceful. You like how every shop is closed? I don't like that part. What so are you looking for? Hand. What is it? It's closed still. So. That's where we're going. Really. That's where we're going. That's where we're going. To see, to see witness for the persecution. Hi guys, it's me. No. Sorry, I don't know. <laughs> Same. Mm -hmm. Oh. <laughs> Slay. Oh, that's better. And now, we're just waiting to go into the theater. Yeah, it's so hot. Right? Yeah, it is. But other than that, Everything's good. How was dinner? Good. I didn't even think of it. That's on. <laughs> I'm gonna add that. We just got back from watching the play. And we really, really liked it. The, the ending was very unexpected. 
What did you think? I liked it. I am. Um, I kind of had a clue. Half. What What do you think about the whole thing? You didn't really like it at the beginning. Not at the beginning because I thought it was really slow. Mm -hmm. But then after I think it picked up. Yeah. Yeah. I really yeah. liked it from the beginning. I thought it was very entertaining. The dialogue was really good, I thought. It's a Nagata Christie play. If you ever want to see very, very good plays at the theater, you should come to the Shaw Festival, which is in Niagara on the Lake, and they have different theaters where they have different plays. It's really, really good. We always come, I think we come at like every year, what, at least once a year, right? At least once a year. Or twice. Twice a year, yeah. We come pretty often, summer and fall usually. And we have a great time. And there's a lot of people that do the same. Some <laughs> some people come from the States as well to see oh. it. And I think also from England and other parts of the world. Oh yeah? Yeah, I think so. It's pretty, right. it's pretty popular. So yes, this is what we did. We had a great time. We went to the Irish pub for dinner and we really, really enjoyed that. Now we're going to bed, and then tomorrow we're gonna go back to Tron. Take exit 35 minutes of running and then I'm going home. Oh my god. I'm almost on my run, as you can tell from this sweaty face. God. Morning, morning, everyone. It's been a while since I actually talked to you. I think the last, yeah, the last video I took was when we were in Niagara on the lake and I was talking about the play. Now I'm back home. Sorry, I have my, <laughs> I have my sheet there drying but i just wanted to show you a new dress that i got from zara which i think it's very very cute so i'm gonna show you what it looks like on um for the first time ever i actually got the right size which is very very rare for me but this is the dress it's this short sleeveless zara red dress i'll show you what it looks like on and the way i would style it Plus, I finally got to go to the dry cleaners and I got so many clothes that I had in my bag to take to the dry cleaners. It was very expensive, I won't lie. I really don't know how it got that expensive, but I ended up paying a lot of money for, okay, quite a, a few pieces. And in those pieces, there was also like a fake leather pant. But still, I have some pieces that I haven't worn in a long time just because they were in that pile of clothes that I was supposed to get cleaned. It's one of those tasks that I just keep pushing and pushing for some reason, but I, I got it done. I also was making my bed and someone really likes jumping on the bed. So I'm dealing with that at the same time. Hello? Hello? Okay, it's a very, very gray day today. Also, sorry for the mess in this room, but I'm kind of in the middle of packing because I'm leaving for Italy in about two weeks. So I'm just deciding on what to take and what to leave. I'm a bit all over the place these days, but it's okay. We roll with it. Okay, so this is the dress, what it looks like on. I style them with my favorite pair of sandals, with my pom-pom sandals. And this is the dress. It's very cute, very comfy and sleeveless. I love the way it feels on. It's very, very comfortable. As a bag, I would style it with my Fendi bag. So this is the look and a red lip because if when you're wearing a red lip dress, why not wear a red lip, right? So this is the look. Oh.
it's like um in fairy tale. Look at all these animals. They're so cute. 